in this section we are going to talk about prefabricated houses project line. There are three types. The one is container, container house. The second one is standard apartment. And we can also have some steel structure projects. So let's start from the standard container. Let's see how it looks like. Here you can see all the parts which are included in the container. Some walls, floor, ceiling, you can have door, windows, and of course it depends on your requirements. You can have two windows, you can have four, three, it's up to you. And here is the process how the container is transported. It's transported in this one bundle and it's shipped in this way. After you unpack it and you have four beams, you first put the floor, beams, the roof and here like that's how you assemble all the parts and then it's just ready to use. Uh, containers can be used for many purposes. One of the purposes is office. You can look here. It can be installed with computers and everything is what is required for the office. So there are some projects that toilets and showers. So for example here like you can you can see clearly so many toilets are installed and here are showers so you can also have containers and use them for multiple floors for example here there are two floors for this project four containers are used so four standard containers and two floors these structures can be up to four floors So let's go through the application cases. So the first one we are going to discuss is civil war camps. You know, sometimes for some huge projects which are far from urban area, it's easier for, for the project to have some camps for workers where they can live. So this project was built in Bolivia. So there's another one. And here we are going to talk about army barracks. So sometimes there are some trainings for the army and some barracks are necessary. So it's very, it's very convenient to build barracks using container houses because it's cheap, because it's fast. So there is another case, uh, Civil Works, we already spoke about it, uh, in Dubai. The other application case is civil engineering offices in Bolivia. We already mentioned offices. So different type of projects can be built with container houses. Here we have a school infrastructure in Aruba. As you can see here, there are two floors built with containers. So there is another school, sorry. There is another school built in Tanzania. As you can see here, that's the, the area and only one floor for this school. So now we are going to talk about standard apartment. There are three types. One bedroom, two bedroom and three bedrooms apartment. So two containers are used for one bedroom apartment. Three containers are used for two bedroom apartments and Four containers are used for three bedroom apartment. There are different MOQ, minimal order quantity. So for one bedroom and two bedroom, the MOQ is four sets 
and for a three dormitory apartment, MOQ is one cent. So let's go, let's have a closer look to the standard apartment, one bedroom. So here you can see one bedroom, one living room, small kitchen and the bathroom. MOQ, as I already mentioned, four sets. So here we have standard apartment with two bedrooms. Here you can see two bedrooms, one living room, bathroom, kitchen, and MOQ is also four sets. Here is a standard apartment with three bedrooms, one, two, three, three bedrooms, and the living room, and kitchen, and the bathroom. And for this type, because it has four containers, uh, the MOQ is one set. Here is the layout, uh, is the design in CAD. So we can design for yours sometimes if you know what you want and maybe you already have this design, you can send it to us. So based on this design, we can make the project. So let's go back to the application cases. Here's a different case. It's a hotel in Costa Rica. It also can be built from containers. So if you are willing to open an hotel or build an hotel, you can have You can scan the QR code and access to our fabricated houses project line on our, on our Alibaba platform. Please feel free to contact us via WhatsApp or WeChat or you can send us email. And I hope you enjoyed this section with me. Please continue watching.